everybody. So my name is Ben Stevens. I am a fifth year PhD student here at the Robotics Institute. Uh, and I'm showing you some of my, some of my research on humanoid robots. Uh, this is our humanoid robot. Uh, it doesn't really have a name. We call it the Sarcos robot because it was built by this company Sarcos. Uh, it's a very unique robot in the, in the field of humanoid robots. It's a full body robot, it has hydraulic actuators, um, it has lots of degrees of freedom and it's roughly human-like in that the proportions and speeds and forces are similar to humans. Um, the task that it's doing right now is a, is a little dance, uh, actually. Um, the dance is actually recorded from human motion capture. So this room is actually a motion capture lab, there are these little cameras all around for capturing human motion. Uh, you put little dots on people, they do a little dance, and you can read in that motion into a computer. Uh, and then what we've done is taken that motion and used it to program a dance on the robot. So it would be really difficult to program a dance on the robot by hand, but by just having a person do a dance, it's really easy. So you get this. Um, the additional difficulty uh, where my research comes in is that uh, it, it has to do this while balancing. So uh, it's not just playing back joint motions, it's, it's actively balancing while trying to follow that motion as well as it could. So if I come up and, and kind of hit it, it's very you know, compliant. Um, and that's more like a person. So a person is constantly adjusting your balance all the time. And so it's not just a rigid robot, it's actually kind of alive. And so while it's swinging its arms around, it has to be adjusting its balance. And so that's, that's what it's doing. My research also fo focuses on, on push recovery, so coming up and giving it a big push, having it take a step, or having it walk and recover um, whenever, whenever, something bump, whenever it bumps into something or something bumps into 